Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with you my April Ipsy unbagging. So if you're interested in finding out with me what's in my bag for this month, then just keep on watching. So here is the bag for this month. It has butterflies on it and then the back of it is purple and then let's see what the theme is so the theme is social butterfly which is why I had butterflies on the bag and there was a brush outside of my bag so I want to open that up first and this is a brush from the brand Basanti I want to say I thought they were a skincare brand maybe I'm getting it confused but this is a concealer buffer brush this is actually a pretty big brush this is something I would probably use this for concealer or for like eyeshadow primer especially so I always love getting brushes I might even use this for like an eyeshadow um, base like to put down like a translucent powder over my eyeshadow all right and then next I have a product here from Ciate London and it's all wrapped up but this says limited edition starstruck eyeliner and stamp oh that might actually be kind of cute if it has like an eyeliner on one side and maybe like a stamp of like a heart or a star or something so the eyeliner side is a black felt tip eyeliner and this is super pigmented very very black it does look a little bit shiny not anything that's like excessively shiny either and then the other side is a star so that might actually be kind of cute it looks like a star every time you know if you get like those stamps sometimes and it could end up just looking like a blob. I feel like that would happen to me. Like I would do a whole eye look and then I would want to add stars and it would just end up looking like random, just a mess. <laughs> so I want to do an eye look using this. I think that could be like super, super cute. They actually look very pigmented and opaque. Like that could be very pretty. So that's kind of cool because that's not anything like I would ever probably buy. But I'm actually happy to have that in my collection now because now I could use it. So next is something from number 7. This is the Early Defense Glow Activating Serum. I actually think that I was sent this recently from number 7. I'm not sure if I've tried this. I might be getting it confused with another product from them. So this is definitely a skincare product. This is a serum and it feels like you could use it like as a primer maybe too but more so probably just as a skincare product so i'm pretty sure i might have this already i just haven't tried it out yet from number seven but they are a really good brand they're kind of like pixie where they're like drugstore but like higher end drugstore too i believe probably around like 20 dollars or so um so i definitely need to give this a go now that i have a little sample size opened up because i don't think i've used the full size that i have yet and it actually feels very silky so i could try that out as a primer or just like under a primer because sometimes i use like three or four primers i like to use like a hydrating primer or something like for pores and stuff and then next this is a loose pigment i believe this is from the brand Meech and Mia. I've never heard of this brand before. It's like a copper shade, so it's a shade that I would definitely use. All right, so this swatch looks so stunning. It feels so like buttery and silky. That is a gorgeous shade. So I definitely wanna try that out as a lid color and just like rubbing it out over and over, it still looks super pigmented. That is just so pretty and if you have like a darker complexion you could probably use this as a highlighter it's like very peachy too oh that looks like a gorgeous shade so usually I don't like products like this in my ipsy bags but this just looks so pretty and it's actually like a color I would wear and lastly this might be sheet mask oh eye mask this is from wander beauty I believe they're at Sephora I don't think I've tried any products from wander beauty this says baggage claim gold eye mask so I actually really really like eye mask just sheet mask anything that's like very quick and easy to use that you don't have to like worry about washing off I use like regular masks too but these are just super quick and easy I'm usually not very excited whenever I get like a sheet mask or something that's just like one-time use in a subscription box but I'm actually excited for these because it's a wander beauty product I haven't tried out this brand yet and it's more of like a high-end brand it says that it has real gold and here the description on the back of this is like very very luxurious and very fancy so i want to try this out um i want to try this out like right away honestly because i'm really excited about these i love eye masks for sure i guess so that is everything for my ipsy i'm bagging for this month the wander beauty eye mask is probably my favorite part of the bag just because i've been wanting to try out wander beauty for a while and then also the ciate london eyeliner um stamp with the star I probably will only use it like a couple times ever, but I think it's like a really fun and different product to have in my bag. Everything else I'll use, but it's not like super exciting either. It's kind of like 
it's just things that are a little bit more practical but not anything that i was missing in my collection either so that is everything that i got in my bag for this month let me know what you guys got in your bags in the comments down below and if you guys like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll talk to you guys soon in my next video thank you so much for watching bye